We spend a lot of time working our bodies, training extremely hard, but I can't emphasize the importance of mobility enough. So I'm gonna give you a handful of my favorite trigger points to maximize our mobility. I have an awesome partner here, and we're gonna go through my five favorites. Starting off with our calf roll. Partner is gonna place herself on her booty and going up and down the calf from the Achilles to the back of the knee. If I was a really good friend, I can help her apply a little bit of pressure. Notice she stays in her happy place the whole entire time. I would spend a minimum of one minute per side on all of these different spots. Coming out of the calf roll, we are going to use this magic mobility ball. And I'll give you a little secret. It looks a lot like a lacrosse ball. And you can pick them up for about $1.99. We're gonna take this guy at the bottom of the hamstring and top of the calf, and then we're gonna bring our hands around, grab onto our ankle, and bring that heel to the butt. So this is now getting a little two for one. We're smashing the hamstring and the calf here and getting a little bit of knee separation. So after all those miles of running and training, this is gonna make sure our knees stay aligned properly. Again, spending about one minute minimal per side. Finishing up with behind the knee, we're gonna roll over onto our stomach and we're gonna go for our VMO. We're gonna kick our leg up over here to the side, this leg here. We're gonna place this guy right here on the inside of that knee, boom. Now we're gonna roll around on our ball. If we find a special spot that starts talking to us, we can stay on that spot and then start bringing that heel to the butt and then opening that leg back up through full range of motion. We're now flossing the muscle on our magic mobility ball. We're gonna come out of there. We're gonna go back to our roller. We're gonna go onto our side for the ever so dreaded IT band. This is an extremely important area. A lot of runners stay away from it because it's a little bit painful. We wanna be on our sides here and we're working our way in between our hip and our knee. We can even roll more into it toward the camera. There you go. Cause it's more painful that way, isn't it? Yes, unfortunately that's what we're looking for. Once we spend about a minute here per side, we're gonna come up out of there and work the top of the hamstring. We're gonna take our magic mobility ball and we're gonna gently place it underneath our hamstring. We're gonna find that area and we can start working that leg into the full range of motion. Gaining tension on that hamstring, stretching yourself through, moving your leg through full range of motion. Now I know that in our training we've been working pull-ups a ton, but we wanna make sure that we maintain that full range of motion with our arms. So we need to loosen up those lat muscles. So we're gonna take our roller from the bottom of our armpit all the way to the bottom of the rib cage. Going back and forth here, pancaking that lat muscle. Now it looks like she's just hanging out the beach. You can almost picture the waves brushing up against her toes like a model in a photo shoot. But actually, she's working on her mobility. This is phenomenal. I honestly believe that mobility is equally important to the hard work that we put in, and it's gonna prepare us to crush Tough Mudder courses. Get yourself a magic mobility ball and get to work.